hi everyone welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new i hope you're all doing well in today's video i'm going to be stuffing our cash envelopes and sinking funds with the first paycheck of december and i'm also going to be going over the budget the paycheck budget just to share where our money is going for this particular paycheck but first things first like i mentioned in yesterday's video if you haven't seen that video i will link it in this corner um, i was going to announce the winner of the 25 dollars random gift card slash cash app um, giveaway i had a few videos ago so i'm going to go ahead and announce the winner right now i did take a screenshot so the winner of the 25 dollars gift card is joanna so joanna congratulations go ahead and i'm actually going to go back to this comment and i will let you know that you won just in case you haven't seen this video and um then we can go from there I didn't just want to choose one winner, so I did choose an additional winner to win a $10 gift card or cash app, and that winner is uh, Half Curly. So Half Curly, congratulations. I don't know your name, so I'm just going to call you Half Curly. <laughs> um, I will also comment on this particular comment just in case you haven't seen this video, and then we can go from there. So congratulations to the winners, and I am going to be having another giveaway in this video but i'm going to talk about all of that at the end of the video so go ahead and stick around if you want to be entered in today's video it is going to be you know a little a little bit more than than that giveaway just because it is my 5k uh subscriber giveaway so thank you guys all so much now let's get started by counting the cash this week we are going to be stuffing not this week but this for this paycheck, we are going to be stuffing $930. Let me give it one quick count. 100, 200, 300, 400. 400. 50, 100, 150. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. 20, 40, 60. 260. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. Plus 60, excuse my dog. Like always, he has to be saying hi in every video. So let me fix these because some of these are way crispier than others. And I'll use the ones that aren't as crispy for my cash envelopes and now i'm gonna go ahead and get um into the budget i'm not going to like zoom you guys in i'll just bring it up to the camera because there's nothing super super interesting going on so let me take this out i always just use a little post-it from um the dollar tree and for the income for the week Altogether, it came out to $2,984 with 39 cents. The first paycheck, Brian did do quite a bit of overtime. So, you know, we're just super blessed and he's been working so hard, but he is going to be off for like 10 days the week before Christmas or the week of Christmas, actually. So I'm like super excited to have him home for a whole 10 days. Um, and he's he just needs a very much needed, you know, rest and reset. So... Uh, vacation pay $506.91 it was a little bit more than the $450 that I had estimated in our monthly budget and then the TA pay was also a lot more $493.25 I think I had estimated like $300 so we are working with quite a bit for the first paycheck which is awesome the bills it's only water and the ADT so that's a total of $168 Cash envelopes, we're going to be stuffing $645 for our extra expenses. Um, there is none for this week. Our sinking funds, we're going to be stuffing $285. And there are no debt payments for this week. And then the week total, so counting, um, totaling up bills, cash envelopes, and sinking funds, we have a week total of $1,098. $930 of that is going to be cash, so cash envelopes, and sinking funds. And then the leftover after we subtract 1098 from 2984 is $1,886 with 39 cents, which we do leave that money in the bank for January's mortgage payment. We do have quite a bit of uh, bills that are going to have to come out 
at the end of December to cover some of January's bills and mortgage is one of them. So we just kind of like to have it sitting in the bank. So by the time that those bills come around, it's already sitting in the bank and we don't have to worry about it. So essentially it is a zero based budget. It just always seems like there's so much money left over, but that money also has a job. So that's pretty much going to be it for the paycheck budget. And now I'm going to go ahead. Why did I just close that? <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and get started with cash envelopes. And we're going to start with gas. And that's going to be $50. We still have 30 here. I'm just gonna give it a 50. And now we have $80. Some of this money, I know it's kind of counterproductive, but it just, it's the way my brain works. Some of this money I have already spent because we're already like, I think today is the 13th. So um, some of this money has already been used. Although I, I kind of, this is just the way I like to do it. I put the money in and if I did spend any, then I will take it out and I'm going to do an unstuffing tomorrow. Yeah, so that's going to be for the second week of January. I mean, January, I'm already jumping ahead of December. So that's it for um, gas. Miscellaneous is $15. 10 and a 5, so that's 16 and it works for me because I am a credit card user. So I have made, you know, many transactions. If you just strictly use cash, then you would have already, you know, pretty much spent your money. So I do have a note section on my phone and I can always reconcile everything um, at the end of the week. And that just so happens to be today. So Pets is getting $20. You might just hear my daughter right now. She's coming down the stairs. <laughs> 20 dollars 6 $46 in pets. Beauty is getting $40. So that's going to be two 20s. And now we have 80 Kids is getting $25. And I completely forgot to unstuff in order for me to put some of this into our Christmas, into our rollover. For Christmas so I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now and then I'll go back to the ones if I want to take any money out so that's a 20 and a 5 and I am going to take this for these four dollars out I'll just place them here on the side I'm gonna take out the the tracker so that I can remember to update it so I'm gonna leave that there now we have 25 in kids for giving it's gonna get five dollars one two three four five and I still have a few singles in my wallet, so I'm not going to add these to that. So um, I do still have quite a bit in giving. And um, I don't know. I always like to just keep it, keep it in here just in case I might need to help somebody. So personal is getting, Brian is going to get 45. So that's 20, two 20s and one five. I will give this to him. And then for me, I'm going to get $20 this week. And I'm going to put them in my, my wallet. So I have this little envelope here. And I don't know if I should roll some of this over. Or if I roll it over, I'm going to roll it in, over into one of my envelopes. Uh, I'll just keep it. Maybe I'll do it next week. So now I have 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. If I'm short in anything, maybe some presents or something, then I can just pull from, from here too. So that's it for personal. Takeout is getting $75. So that's a 50, a 20, and a 5, 75. And groceries is going to get $300. One, two, three. And there is $5 in here. I'm going to leave it in here. Um, so $305. So for this first paycheck, I did budget $300. But for the following three paychecks, I think it's only going to be, let me see. I budgeted 550 minus 300. Divide that by three. It's going to be around $85 the following three weeks. Now, if we need more money, of course, we can always just budget more. But that's kind of the plan. And household is getting $50. There's $1 in here. 
So now there's 51. I am going to leave it in here because I am running out. We're not running out. I'm lying. But I always like to have everything stocked up. So I'm going to buy some um, detergent, softener, toilet paper, paper towels. Just all of the stuff that we have to replenish. Just so that I don't have to be running out last minute. And that's it for that. Nothing in extras. Now I'm going to go back and take out... So in miscellaneous, that single dollar, I'm going to take it out. And I will also take out the tracker just to update that so I can remember. And then, let me see, where else? I think that's it, honestly. Maybe in, maybe in gas. Let's go ahead and take out... Um, no, never mind. We are going to go to a Laker game on the 18th. Um, Brian got some tickets, some free tickets from his job, so that's awesome. So um, it is quite a bit of a drive, so I do want to keep it just in case. Um, and we are done with cash envelopes. Let me place it. I'm just going to place it here. I act like I don't have the room. So um, I'm going to go ahead and start with the first sinking funds binder. And for emergency fund... We are adding $20. Let me place these forward. So that's 20 here. And now for emergency fund, we have 500, 550, 570, 590, 610, 630, 650, 670, 690, 710, 730, 750, 770, 775, 780, 785, 790, 795, $800. We have $800 an emergency fund. I don't think we will reach the thousand dollars, but you know, close enough. As much as we can get it to a thousand dollars. This is not the only emergency fund that we do have. We do have around five to six months of emergency expenses in our high yield savings account. This is just kind of like, you know, any miscellaneous, but it is an emergency we can pull from here. So home maintenance is getting fifty dollars. So I'll do two twenties and one ten. So in home maintenance, now we have 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 1000, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, 2000, 2100, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 270, 290, 305, 6. 1306 dollars not one thousand two thousand three hundred and six dollars um we do have to replace half of our roof i have mentioned it many many times if you have watched many of my videos i'm sorry that i repeat myself but you know there's people that are new and then they come to my channel and they just don't know don't know what i'm talking about so um they might want to know why there's so much money in certain envelopes and i just you know i like to share so car maintenance is getting twenty dollars If you get tired of the repetition, let me know. I won't get I won't get butt hurt, I swear. So 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 220, 21, 22, 23, 24. 224 dollars in car maintenance. Annual bills is getting five dollars. So now we have 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 220, 40, 60, 80. 85, 90, 95, 310, 20, 21, 22, 23. 323 in annual bills. The next upcoming annual bill we have um, is going to be the Sam's Club membership, the Xbox Live Gold, I believe ABC Mouse for my daughter. I think I locked in a promotion where the whole year was going to cost me $45 for ABC Mouse. I'm hoping. It is like even if I if I keep the yearly membership, they'll still be forty five dollars. I'm pretty sure it's still gonna be forty five dollars, which is great because what forty five dollars divide that by twelve, it's like I'm only paying three seventy five a month for ABC Mouse. So whenever you see that type of promotion, jump on it, and um, then tax preparation. You know, we're trying to do our taxes early this year because last year we waited to do them even after the april the last day of april but we didn't get in trouble or anything so that's it for um annual bills a month ahead 
nothing and in bills or in cash. We're gonna start that next year. Health is getting five dollars. So now health has 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96. And um, I think we're done here. Oh no. Vacation is getting five dollars. So now in vacation, there's one, two, three, four, five hundred, five fifty, six hundred, six twenty, six forty, six sixty, six eighty, seven hundred, seven twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, eight hundred, eight hundred and twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, nine hundred and twenty, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty, fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, nine hundred and fifty-seven 40, 60, 80, 900, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 957 dollars in vacation. I still haven't um, done an appointment to get our passports, and I'm actually going to do that today because um, the last time I checked online there was a few days left in December and then January was all blocked off so yeah we don't want to leave that for the last minute and um, we do have the money here and we also have $900 in a high yield savings account in my ally um, high yield savings account in one of the buckets so um, that is including so technically we have over $1,800 already saved up for vacation christmas is getting actually it's not getting anything it's going to get the rollover which we will go over actually right now so i'm going to add it in here and with these additional five dollars so now we have well for rollover it's going to be 20 40 60 65 70 75 80 85 90 95 96 97 98 99 100 it's actually the $100 that I had. Um, it was the goal for December to have $100. I don't know if we are going to be needing more money. But if we do, we can always just pull, pull from somewhere. So um, let, me, let me grab a black pen. Today's the 13th. So we are adding from a rollover. $100. So now we're going to have, we should have $872. Let's go ahead and check that. $872. So $500, That's correct. We have the $872. And rollover, now there's nothing. Excuse that sound if you heard it, it's my pool pump. So um, that's it for this binder. And now we're gonna go into the this lavender binder here. First is gonna be family fun. We have $51, so now we have 61. And let's go over to Birthdays, I'm going to add $120. So that's 120. And that's going to be for, um, I want to have it fully funded for Isaiah's and Brian's birthday gift. If I need to dip into this, then I have it, which I already have their gifts. So I'm going to be on stuffing some of this. So now there's 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 220, 40, 45, 50, 50, 152. And let's go over to holidays. Holidays is going to get $10. So in holidays, now we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 110, 20, 30, 35, 40, 41, 42. $142. And this is going to be mainly for like the food and um, Christmas food and drinks. And now let's go into, I think that's it. Oh no, home decor is getting $5. Now there's 20, 40, 60, 80, 105, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. 150 dollars in home decor. By the way, what are you guys going to be eating or making if you are going to be the ones hosting Christmas dinner or you know just Christmas? What are you going to be eating? We are going to be having tamales 
I believe pozole and I don't know, probably some Puerto Rican dishes mixed in there. I'm not too sure, but for sure we're going to have tamales and pozole, which I love both things equally. So what are you going to be having for Christmas? That's going to be it for here. And now the last thing is my kids, my kids envelopes. So I'm going to start off with my daughter, Brienne. She is going to get $5. Whoops. I'm still trying to get used to these envelopes. So now she has 1,000, 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 200, 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 300, was it 200? 305, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 1,320. My son Phoenix is going to get $10. So now he has 1,000, 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 200, 220, 240, 260, 270, 280, 290, 310, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1390 for Phoenix. With the upcoming um, tax, I'm pretty sure we're going to get a tax return, crossing our fingers. A pretty hefty one if anything um and we will be adding some additional money in here for them other than like the five and ten that we usually put per week so now that for my son josiah he's getting one he has 1000 20 40 60 80 100 20 40 60 80 200 20 40 60 80 300 310 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90. I don't have a goal. We don't have a goal of how much um, to have by the time, you know, they are of age. And my son Isaiah is going to get the last $15. We're just trying to put as much as we can into their savings. And then, um, you know, hopefully it's a hefty amount to get them started into their adulthood. Unfortunately, Isaiah is probably going to get a little bit less than... Um, our other kids because he is going to be turning 17 so he doesn't have very much time to you know to become an adult but um of course we will still help him if he needs to into his adulthood and um also our other kids but they still they do still have a little bit more time for us to be able to save for them so now isaiah has 1100 200 300 400 450 500 520, 540, 560, 580, 620, 40, 60, 80, 710, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1800 dollars now. So he is close to two thousand dollars. Maybe, maybe by the end of this year. We'll see. And then that's gonna be it for this binder, and pretty much that's gonna be it for this video. Like I mentioned at the beginning of this video, I'm going to get into the 5,000 subscriber giveaway. So it is going to be pretty simple. I don't like to make things too complicated. So there's going to be three winners. One of the winners is going to get a $50 gift card or cash app, whichever you prefer. And then the other two winners are going to receive $25 gift card or cash app, whichever you prefer. And now to enter, you must be publicly subscribe to my channel, like this video, and just leave me a comment letting me know your name or your nickname if you're not comfortable sharing your name. Um, you know, just because we have this relationship online and some people, I don't know their name. I know some of you guys' name, but not everybody. And I just want it to be a little bit more, you know, personable. It's not just me behind the screen and then you, you're just a comment. You know, that's not what it is at all. I consider, I honestly consider you guys friends. I'm always calling everybody my friend. Um, <laughs> I don't have very many friends. Uh, so you guys are all my friends. Anyway, so yeah, just let me know your name and where you're from. Just your name, where you're from. And then um, that's it. That'll get you entered into today's giveaway. It's just a small way to let you know that you are very, very much appreciated. 
I will have a comment pinned in the comment section letting you know when I'm going to be announcing the winners just because I haven't thought about it honestly so um that's gonna be the end of this video you guys if you made it up until this point thank you thank you thank you so much and i'm going to let you go here i hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day or night see you next time bye